A club has 256 members of whom 144 can play football, 123 can play tennis. I am already thinking set theory. 132 can play cricket, 58 can play both football and tennis, 25 can play both cricket and tennis, 63 can play both football and cricket. So we have been given A, B, C, A intersection B, B intersection C, C intersection A. If every member can play at least one game, that means A union, B union, C is this, there is nothing outside of this. And what do we know? We know that A union, B union, C is A plus B plus C minus A intersection B minus B intersection C minus C intersection A plus A intersection B intersection C. In this question, the question asks us for how many players who can play only tennis. Right? So the Venn diagram approach is going to come into play, but here we need to be smart. You can say, look, I'm not going to fill every number and solve it algebraically. I've been given six of these and this, I will find this and then I'll go to the diagram. So 256 equals 144 plus 123 plus 132 minus 58 minus 25 minus 63 plus x. These three we need to add 3 plus 5, 8 plus 8, 16, 6, 1, 7 plus 2, 9, 9 plus 5, 14. So minus 146. 144 plus 143 plus 132 minus 146. 144 minus 146 is minus 2. 120, 130 minus 132 minus 2 is 130. So we're going to have 123 plus 130. 253 is this computation. So 253 plus x is 256 or x is 3. Now we can come back to the diagram angle of this. Let's say we have football here, tennis here, cricket here. We need to focus only on tennis. This is 123. This number in between is 3. Football and tennis is 58. So this is 55. 58 minus 3. Cricket and tennis is 25. 25 minus 3 is 22. So these 3 account for 58 plus 22, which is 80. Out of 123, 80 have been accounted for. Remaining 43 play tennis only. Done.